All right, guys, Josh Tech Gamer back again with another video. I did purchase some keycaps. This brand is by Polycaps. Uh, these are called the Octopus keycaps, and these are PPT double shot keycaps. Very durable. So, yeah. No ABS here. We don't do ABS. So, I did purchase these on the website because I am actually building another keyboard. And I just saw these octopus purple and the dark purple and the light pink. I had to get these keycaps. Now, I did purchase these and this was new to me. I did notice they were a lot slimmer and they are cherry profile. I did not know that until after I bought them. Now I figured out what are cherry profiles and what are OEM profile keycaps. The keycaps are two different sizes. This is slightly slimmer. So yeah, that's what you're gonna notice. If you don't like that, I don't recommend to get cherry profile keycaps. And if you don't like your keycaps, no backlit, I don't recommend these. If you want backlit, then yeah, I'll probably get the matrix keycaps or something like that. Also use Josh Tech Gamer and get a little discount. I did purchase these. These were $64 for these keycaps. That is real good deal because they do go up from 100 to 150 to $200 for keycaps. Uh, yeah, they get really pricey. So <laughs> I was really shocked when it came out to actually $77 with the shipping total. So I did try these on the GK61 keyboard that I have mod. I took off the matrix keycaps just to see what it would look and sound like. These keycaps look really good, I'm telling you. Freshly for the price. Now there is one thing I do not like on the keycap and the RGB shine through. It back bleeds a little bit of light through the escape and enter key. That's the only thing I noticed. This way you could solve that is two ways. You could turn off your RGB or turn it all the way down. Or you could change out the switches. The switches I'm using is the Gateron yellow switches. Now the light shines through the Gateron yellow switches more. So different switches have a housing on top of the switch where it can block out the RGB light. And also this keyboard is north face RGB. So the light shines on top and a lot of keyboards um, like the more higher end keyboards, the light goes down south. Now, if you guys are wondering what that means, the little light when you take out the switch is south and not north. So that's the only thing. Then the light won't shine through the keycap. So yeah, a lot of boards do that. So be careful when you purchase your board. If you like backlit, then watch out for those boards and these keycaps. But honestly, for $77 for these keycaps, they really pop. Now, when I took the keycaps out, I was actually surprised how sharp they were. Yes, the edges of the keycaps were very sharp. So just be careful when you grab them. I don't think they're like razor sharp, but they, they have a little sharp edge to them. The quality looks great. Also, it comes with the desk pad. The desk pad is out of stock. Hopefully, it will be in stock soon because I am going to be purchasing this real soon to match the board check out these keycaps from kinetic labs and also they have other things if you want to build a custom keyboard they have lube crytox 205g0 brushes and switch pullers and stuff but since you're getting these keycaps here if you do purchase these you can just check out their other stuff in their checkout i don't have any codes or affiliate links with this company so i did purchase this with my own money because honestly i like the purple and the pink as you know, in my previous videos, I have a lot of pink and purple. It just looks really good and it just pops. It makes everything stand out more. So, um, you can use them for gaming. You could use them for typing. That's what they're mostly meant for, but you can use them for whatever you want. So, like I said, if you don't like backlit keycaps and you like the keycaps to light up, I do not recommend these. I just want to do a little short video on this and stuff before we go we'll do a sound test real quick and you guys can hear what this keyboard sounds like so yeah let's get into it
man, this keyboard sounds really good for what I did. Lube the switches and the stabilizers and add these custom keycaps. The board sounds really good. It has that nice thock sound. Just remember, different keycaps and different boards are going to sound completely different. It's on the material and everything you're using and stuff. So some keyboards may sound better than others, even though if you're doing the same thing. But also remember this, if you buy a $50 keyboard and you buy a $350 keyboard and you put extra work into the stuff and add some real Duroc stabilizers and not these ones that come with the board, it's going to sound 10 times better. All right, guys, but that's about it. Thanks for watching Josh Tech Gamer. I appreciate it. I can't wait to do this custom keyboard build. It will be coming soon. I want to do a good quality non-backlit keycap keyboard that's you know durable and i figured i go 65 percent. i don't have that board i only have 60 in tkl 10 keyless keyboard so yeah all right guys thanks for watching josh tech gamer and i'll check you guys later